Hey there and welcome to another Dave Does Reaction and today we are checking out the band Blackstone Cherry and the thing, song is Things My Father Said. This is a top 10 challenge video request by Brian Logue. So uh, I'm getting a vibe for the videos that you're requesting. Uh, so I hope you're well uh, and doing okay. Um, although I could be completely wrong, but I've just based on the videos I've just been reacting to on your list. Uh, let's go do this. This is Blackstone Cherry and Things My Father Said. If you like the video, please do subscribe, click the bell icon, like, share, leave the comments down below, get involved with the challenges. If you want to support the channels, you can do so through Patreon, you can do so through uh, song requests. Uh, what else can you do? You can do the Right Inside Craft Shop, which is a craft shop I run. Uh, and also you can do so via the Man Camp with the Nothing Gain. All details are in the description down below. Let's do this. It's a, this is a scored reaction, so it's scored out of 10, 10 categories. Details of which are going to come going whizzing bram, across the screen. Let's do this. Blessed Only Cherry and Things My Father Said. 3, 2, 1, a go. So I have got an album, maybe two, one or two albums of Blackstone Cherry. So I'm not sure if I, this doesn't ring any bells yet so far. The things my father said would make me a better man. How do I get the love of friends? A woman that understands. Nice vocals, I like it. At night I go to sleep and pray here's watching all I be somewhere there's a star that shining so bright that I can see a smile and all that I need is one last chance just to hear you say. I like the energy.
Okay, so Blackstone's Cherry and Things My Father Said. I'll put these down. So songs like these are a difficult one for you kind of to do a reaction to because they have such personal meaning to the people that listen to them. Um, so if you've lost your dad, uh, so if your father passed away uh, and you would to listen to this, you would connect to it on a huge level compared to someone like myself who hasn't lost their dad. Um, uh, so you wouldn't, I mean, you could try and think about losing your dad, which is a horrible thing to think about, but and try to connect with them as a reactor. Uh, but, and that's difficult, I think. So not taken away from people that connect to it on an emotional level. So I think for, if, if you connect to it on an emotional level, I can see how a song like this is uplifting, uh, something you can connect to, something you can relate to, something that can try and help you get through certain things by allowing you an, another outlet for emotion. Uh, from a musical point of view, so I thought, so the lyrics, initially I kind of scored them quite high, and I think I'm going to leave the scoring as I initially scored it. Some of the lyrics were quite cheesy, but I guess they were trying to give you metaphors, not metaphors, sorry, not metaphors, more memories, memory-based, sort of building the car, and uh, what are some of the other ones I saw in there that, remember you taught me how to tie my shoes, stuff like that lyrically is kind of, I Again, it's it's there to trigger an emotion, but when you've not got that connection, it just feels like a bit of a wishy-washy lyric uh, from my from that point of view. But again, it's been written for that particular connection piece, so you're going to listen to this because you've got a reason behind it. Um, so I think I've, I've kind of laboured that point a little bit too much on that one. Uh, verses and choruses were all fine. They're just kind of they're very samey sort of chord structures. So nothing, so nothing's massive there from a musical point of view. Good pacing throughout uh, and a strong production. Was it production? Yes, strong production from the band to get a good overall sound. Um, and I like I like the soulfulness of the guys singing. Uh, so that was a nice kind of uh, sort of touch to that particular track. Um, yeah, it was nice. I think you have to have that emotional context for that song to, for it to, to mean more to you. Uh, for me, as an abject listener, I'm just listening to it from a purely musical point of view, and it, it didn't connect with me on that level. Uh, but I don't know. Let me know your thoughts on it. So from people, so obviously there's going to be people out there that are going to watch this video and have that connection so i'm sure you'll give me your feedback in the comments down below and there'll be others that probably listen to this from a who haven't got that connection and again i'd love to hear your comments in the details down below thank you very much for uh watching if you like the video please do subscribe click the bell icon like share leave the comments down below and that of course is how dave does it